welcome to Ludic Science. In a previous video, we made this incandescent lamp in order to demonstrate the principle of operation. However, the filament burned out quickly. The filament was a pencil lead and we put it on these alligator clips and some of the air was extracted by burning a piece of paper. However, the filament burned out in a few seconds. In this new version, I will use a filament made of tungsten wire. Tungsten was the metal used in commercial incandescent lamps, so we should have a better performance. Next time you need a PCB for your electronics project, consider using the professional services of JLC PCB. JLC PCB is the world leader in PCB fabrication. You can order online. You just need to register, upload your Gerber file, and wait a few days for your PCBs at an unbeatable price. The filament is in place, so let's repeat the experiment. The filament burned even quicker than in the previous version. However, I noticed that it was touching the glass, so that may affect. So let's repeat. Okay, same thing happened. Let's make one last try with a longer filament that is in the form of a spiral, as it is on the incandescent lamps. Well, it seems that the tungsten wire is too thin for these current levels. And comparing with the pencil lead, we can see that it is definitely more thin. Okay, so there it is. I hope you liked this video. 
Thanks for visiting my channel and see you in the next one.